Step aside, Grand Theft Auto V for the PlayStation 3. Because next gen Grand Theft Auto V for the PlayStation 4 has finally arrived. What's up everybody and welcome to my quick little unboxing of Grand Theft Auto 5 for the PlayStation 4. That is right, the next gen Grand Theft Auto has finally arrived. And here it is in all of its glory, Grand Theft Auto 5 PlayStation 4 Edition. Immediately to get remove some glare, let me just take the plastic off and we can see if we get that new game smell to it. With that nice first person mode, all new textures and features. I cannot wait to pop this into my PlayStation 3. Let's remove that nice, shiny, fresh, factory sealed plastic. And let's take a look at the cover. Same cover from the previous Grand Theft Auto. Five on the PlayStation 3, same cover. Take a look at the side, Grand Theft Auto 5. Obviously the Rockstar logo. If my camera will focus, you'll be able to see it a lot more clearly. And there you go. Perfect. Rockstar. And this is the back. Rockstar Games presents a Rockstar North production. And you can read the full thing right there real quickly. Got some screenshots. Includes Grand Theft Auto Online. There is a 55 gigabyte minimum to install this thing on your PlayStation 4. God damn. And obviously this game is rated M for Mature. Obviously. Alright, let's crack this thing open and get that new game smell to it. Ah, yes. There goes that new game smell. This is what it looks like on the inside. Here's the new next gen Grand Theft Auto 5 PS4 disc. As you can see, it's different to the PlayStation 3 one, which I will get right here. Here's the PlayStation 3 Grand Theft Auto disc. And there is the PlayStation 4 disc. And I'm pretty sure in about a couple of weeks, Lindsay Lohan will be suing Grand Theft Auto Rockstar once again for using her likeness, apparently. Yeah, okay, sure, Lindsay. Anyway, let's see what you get on the inside. First, claim you one million dollars. One million dollars! In game. Ah, I thought it was one million dollars in cash. Damn it. Anyway, you get five hundred thousand dollars for Grand Theft Auto V and five hundred thousand dollars for Grand Theft Auto Online. I'm pretty sure the code's on the back. Yeah, yes, it is, but this is. Just a paper that you get inside. And then, of course, you get the manual for the game, similar to the um, PlayStation 3 version. Grand Theft Auto Online on the back. Tells you a bit about the controls. Basic. And last but not least, you get the map. Which is, once again, the same as Grand Theft Auto for the PlayStation 3. And then you also get some artwork in the back here. Let's take a look at that. You get the nice Vinewood side. That's on the inside. You can use this as an alternate cover if you want. I choose not to. Because that's just me. But either way, that does it for my quick little unboxing of Grand Theft Auto V for the PlayStation 4. Next gen Grand Theft Auto is finally upon us. I can't wait to play this. I put the cover on backwards like a freaking idiot. Let me see if I can fix that. There we go. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't done so already. And I will see you guys on the next unboxing video. But until then, this is L. Tillman signing out.